Welcome back guys, before we continue with the video, make sure you like and subscribe and turn that, that little bell on so you can get the notifications that when we make a new video, you will be the first to watch it. Welcome to another episode of Nerd Sheet. My name's Gabriel. And I'm Nick, guys. That's right. He's Nick, guys. Nick, guys. Nick, Nick. guys. Nickelodeon. Oh, copyright. Nickelodeon. All right. <laughs> so, um, we're here with another Nerd Sheet video for you. Not uh, a podcast. A video. Video. Which for you haven't seen. For L YouTube. <laughs> That's how you say YouTube in Spanish. <laughs> and we are... Really what are we doing? Unboxing. Unboxing. We took a... What does unboxing mean? Well, no. First, we took a video. Well, we're taking uh, My Bro Comics videos. We're doing an unboxing this time. Our good friends at My Bros do a lot of unboxings for their comic books and CGC submissions. Uh, I don't even know what CGC stands for, but I did it. <laughs> I did it. This is Gabe's official first CGC order. Yes, like I, his, I, he's never sent books in. I have books that are CGC certified, but I just buy them like that because I find it much easier and it, cheaper. It is. But that's just me. I guess it depends what book you find and yeah. where to submit it. But you know, sometimes it, it you can depends. get a treasure. Yeah, it all depends. I mean, this is probably this is uh, from I made a CGC account what like two years ago now, maybe about two years ago, three years ago. I don't know, something like that. One of the Comic Cons I started it, and. uh I do find it a little cheaper depending on the book. Like, if you buy a high raw book from somewhere else, then, yeah, it's more expensive. But, like, say when you go to Newberry or, like, any other store, you buy it, it's 3 $4 for that book. Yeah. So then it's cheaper. But then you also got to weigh that against, yeah. is it worth, is it worth? certifying yeah, yeah, yeah. or not? So or is it a key issue? Will yeah. it become more high value yeah, with exactly. time, you know? It's... Like, first appearance of Null... That that's a big a more book now. that's a modern book. Yeah. Only came out what was it last year or the year before? 2018. Two years ago. Well, three years ago. Three years now. ago, it's 2021. Oh, happy new year. Happy new but, year. But um you know, a book like that, who knew how huge, huge it was gonna be? And those people who got the issue right away, like I'm sure Nick did, and sent couple. that yeah. in to get certified, you know, that's big money right there. Yeah. So, no, yeah. They um Never know. I definitely don't have the same amount as like Nettie. Nettie has like eight. I don't have any. I'm I not, have two. I have two or three. I'm not subscribed to any comics. <laughs> so I read them on my phone. So it it um yeah I don't like that. I don't know how you could still do that. Oh, I, love I can't it. I can't read on my. I love I feel, it. Uh, I still like holding the Comicsology. That's I love that app. I mean, they're not even paying us. Why are you saying their name? Uh, I pay them. <laughs> pay us. No, you pay them. I pay them. <laughs> Free sponsorship. But no, so you have one more book that's actually being yeah, pressed. I submitted three. Three. We got two back. One of them is getting pressed. Yes, so that takes a long time. So being getting pressed means basically they're... So you know how when you get a book, if you have getting a book... Stop. You, what? what are you getting doing? Getting a book. Yeah. Getting a book. So, and if you see, like, there's imperfections in the book, like creases or binds, which is at the end of the book, bind bends. Blemishes, so, beauty marks. Yeah, stuff like that. All of it. <laughs> That's a different, this is not that kind of YouTube channel. It's like channel. we're sending the book to the spot. <laughs> yeah, basically. So, basically, they're going to press out some of those. If it's color breaks, they might not come out. These books didn't get pressed, so. These are just straight, straight. raw. You didn't really care about Monday the Monday night raw. <laughs> what? <laughs> You didn't care about the grades, right? No, this one, I mean... One was for your collection. One is... is I actually sent this in. Amazing Spider-Man 122. This is, uh, I guess... Was it a poster? It's wood. But that one. Whatever. Nick got me plaque. that. That's a plaque. Yeah, a plaque. This plaque a few years back, and it's one of my favorite plaques. So, Scott gave me the actual comic issue a few years back because he knew how much I love this cover. And... That's I've the, kept it, and Nick was like, hey, you want to submit, submit some books? books. I was yeah. like, yeah, I'll submit this one. Not really caring what the grade yeah. is because I'm going to keep it. I'm going to frame yeah. it, yeah. hang it up hang somewhere it up in somewhere. this room. So, 
The other one was Swamp Thing Swamp number thing. seven. And Swamp Thing number seven, we could talk about it uh, once we pull out the book. Uh, yeah. I don't really care about the grade, but it's worth the, a little you, bit of money. Got, I guess I'll sell it if I have to. If yeah. not, I'll just keep it. I don't keep care. It. Just keep it for a while. Just keep it. It's an old book because yeah. it's actually Swamp Thing 7 and Amazing Spider-Man 122, which is 122 is the issue after Gwen Stacy's death, right? Yes. So it's a pretty big book. Not as big as 121, but still a good book to have. Yes. I like Absolutely. it. Absolutely. Right? I like this cover better than one twenty. So Gabe cover. hasn't seen this at all. I literally yeah, just I have no it. idea what the grades are. Yeah, so. I know them because it comes up on my account. But let's open these up. You want to do it? You want to take them out of the? Sure. Which ones first? They're, they're together. They they comp. Yep. Yeah, one. <laughs> yeah. I mean, they have to make sure that's of import. No, my address. <laughs> no one needs to know where I live. Jeez, Gabe. <laughs> Ooh, Swamp Things first. All right. That's a good see. one to start. Ooh, 4.5. A lot higher than I thought. <laughs> I know. I made it seem like it was going to be worse than what it was for you. Wow. Swamp Thing number seven. So that book came out in 73, I believe. As it should say. So what I like, CGC, they put Oh, yeah. Look at that. 73. 1973. Batman appearance. First meeting of Swamp Thing and Batman. So actually, in this issue... Swamp Thing is in Gotham, Gotham City. This is Gotham City on the cover here. It's his first time going to Gotham City. Uh, Commissioner Gordon's in it. I didn't even get to look at yeah, it. Yeah, Alfred's in it. And it's a pretty cool issue. And actually, I read special trivia. This is one of the first times Batman does the whole disappearing thing on Commissioner Gordon. Is it really? Yeah. Is this, I did not know that. See, that's pretty... Dang, I would have told them to put that in the corner. <laughs> no, I didn't know pretty, that. That's a pretty cool trivia that's, I didn't for this know issue. that. Yeah. Uh, the, so from looking from it, it looks pretty good. So, like, that's what I was saying. So, like, if you got the press, like, that one might have been out. And so, like, if you did press it, you might have gotten, like, a 5, 5.5, maybe a little bit more. But it definitely is a lower quality grade, but which is fine, though. It's still a nice Four point. Album. I thought it was going to be, like, 2.5. No, no, no. I would have told you that. I told you it's a lower grade, but it's not too but bad. But 4.5 ain't bad. I'm pretty yeah. happy with this. Yeah. It's dope. And it looks nice. I like, yeah. But you see how with CGC, the difference is, like, when you first get the book and not buy it, like, you see how much more colorful, shiny. That's why I like Very these. clean. Yeah. I mean, awesome. A little unfair. I can get that fixed. Um, I haven't seen the Swamp Thing TV show. I haven't either. I need to watch it. Put I think it's on in, HBO Max. Put this back in the slip. It wasn't there the slip. Put it back in the sleeve. Oh. You don't want to lose that shit. I mean, I... Yeah, yeah. Put that back I in just, the sleeve. I just throw everything. Yeah, I know. Jesus, man. Put she that back in the sleeve. Off. Okay. Ready for the next one? I'm ready. This is this is uh, one of my favorite comic book covers. Hold that real quick. 5.0. Check it out. Is that better than what you thought? Nope. You thought it was going to be a 5.0? No. What you thought it was I thought be? it was going to be a little higher. Ah, uh, see, so it's all right. Because we can... But I'm not selling it, so yeah, it doesn't so matter. Yeah, so it's your, it's your book. Got it Good nice box. and framed. You see that, Scott? Thanks for your gift. And now it's in this awesome CGC thing. And uh, what are these called? Let me see. Uh, like? Uh, slab. Like, oh, slabs. That's the... That's the Slabby. That's the slab. Slabby. Slabbing it up it. up here. I like. Let me go connect shop. See, like that's what I was saying. Like if you got a press, like these might have been taken out. But I th I like the. Grade. I love it's, this. It's not that great, dude. Yeah, this issue though. Yeah, um, it's a really cool cover. I like that cover a lot. Green Spider Goblin. Spider Man's really trying to kill Green Goblin in this. And actually, if you remember Spider Man with Tobey Maguire, where Green Goblin is with his glider going to stab Peter, but. Peter gets out the way and stabs himself. That's in this That's issue. In, yeah, I was about That's to say what that happens, happens here. And also you see Harry Osborn high on LSD because he <laughs> has a drug problem. So that's pretty cool. Um, yeah, okay. it's dope. I love this cover see, mainly because of the colors on it. I'm going to make sure there's no uh, imperfections on the cover on the book because then you can get it re-slabbed. The only thing, I've never done this before, but say if like, I think you can... If you want to get it taken out of the... You can actually send it back to CGC and get it pressed. So they would basically crack open the slab nice. and redo it if you really want. But I, I, 5.0... If I, I think was selling it, I would have pressed it. Yeah. But I am not selling it. Mean, no, no. Keep that. I love the color. Yeah, like there's the, a lot of colors in yeah, this Yeah, that's cover. why I like that issue. One actually. of my favorite comic book covers. 
Are you going to hook it? You should try to move that one out and put it this right next to it or right under it. Something, you know what I'm saying? You can try to maybe... I'm going to have my own wall with all my CGCs. Jeez, I can't do that. Daddy can't do that either. Well, There's I don't too have many. that many, so... <laughs> we'll, we'll go to your collection. I do have right. first appearance of Carnage, though. <laughs> <laughs> I also have first appearance of Silk. That's a good issue, too. And I have first appearance of Miles Morales, of course. Are you going to send more books in, do you think? Uh, Probably not. No, why? I don't know. So if you don't, so if you get your book, did you move it? Which one? If you get this cover or like this cover. If I had Amazing Spider-Man 50, I would be so happy. Are you going to send it in though? You would, right? If I had that issue. This yeah. issue too. Well, that yeah, that's, come <laughs> You're on. You're never going to find that issue. No way I'm getting that if one. If someone finds that issue raw, I would be re- yeah. I've never seen a raw issue of Amazing Fantasy. Yeah, no. It I've seen them be, already yeah. slabbed. That's it. This one, 151, would be a dope one to do though. I gave you, didn't I give you one? I, I gave, yeah, yeah, I gave you one of those, I think. I'll think about it. We'll see. So, I mean, well, I'll look around because I know I don't have issue 50. But I think I can find one for... I mean, Spider-Man in general is just going up crazy. But what did you wish this was? Or what did you think it was going to be? I was hoping for at least a seven. But, you know, yeah, if can... I was selling it, I would be more worried. Really, I don't care. Yeah, no. I, at least I feel like as long as you get a 5.0 for a cover like this for you to keep, I would be happy if I was you. I, I think it's a decent grade. Sorry, it's been a while since we did I know, one of these videos, I was just thinking so. that. I'm like, wow, this is weird. <laughs> so, Nerd Sheet, we're going to keep bringing you videos like this, maybe unboxings. Uh, the other it, book that I sent in to get pressed, because I do have an intention of selling that one, is the first appearance of Taskmaster. Which is like Avengers, like, I forget. It's like Avengers... One like, something? One something, 136, I don't know. I don't know. I forget. I'm not that great with numbers. But he is also going to be in the Black Widow movie. Which should have came out already. Should have came out, <laughs> but hopefully when it does come out, I'll have the book already. A little, little movie tax. And, hi, Roxy. Hi, Roxy. And it'll be worth a little more. So we'll see what happens. We'll do. We'll probably unbo- do an unboxing for that, too. I actually just sent in my Donny Cates Ryan segment books. So nice. In like two months, I'll get those back. So I'll be excited for those. Awesome. Maybe we'll do more. Yeah. Nerd yeah. sheet. Nerd sheet. Make sure you subscribe, <laughs> follow, check out our podcast. It's on Spotify and a few other podcasting websites. Roxy, stop hitting the tripod. <laughs> and uh, f- yeah, follow me, uh, Nerd Sheet, that ev- everywhere Twitter, Instagram, YouTube, Nerd Sheet. Uh, where can people fa- find you? I'll Mr. be on. Uh, uh, Instagram, Nicholas8392. Twitter is Nikki8392. And uh, you guys will see a lot of my comics. As soon as I get them, I actually post them on a highlight. So check out that highlight of all my comics, CGC and Rock Comics. So please check those out. If you want to buy some, you can. Just let me know. Yeah. <laughs> we haven't been in front of the camera. Make sure you check out Maya Bros, too. Yes. They do a lot of unboxings. If you're looking... For a comic book YouTube channel, they're the ones to follow. Thanks, guys. Nerd Sheet out. Nerd. Sheet. Hey, guys. Hope you enjoyed the video. Please make sure you subscribe to Nerd Sheet. And also make sure post notifications are on. That way you can view all our videos right away. Go check out all the other ones now. They should be somewhere on the screen. Nerd sheet out.